Hi guys, I'm going to quickly show you how to cite your images for your book trailers. So here I am at creativecommons.org. I'm going to click on search the commons. And then I actually like Flickr the best. You know you can always go to Pixabay because everything at Pixabay underneath that first row is copyright free. But here I like Flickr because Flickr gives you all the information that you need for the proper citation. So. Um, by default, usually this use for commercial purposes is checked off. So if it is, make sure you uncheck that. And then I am going to search for cows. So when I search for cows, I'm searching for on Flickr, on the website Flickr. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, this guy's pretty cute. I'm going to use him. And so with Flickr, all the information is down here, which is great. So the title of this, if I go over to my template for what I need, I need the title of the image and it's going to be in quotation marks. I know I have a ton of tabs open. Okay, so I'm going to just copy this because the title of this is cow. I'm going to go back over and I'm simply going to paste this in. Now I'm not just going to control V, I'm actually going to go up to file, or I'm sorry, edit, paste without formatting because then it's the same um, font. If I didn't do that, here I'll show you what would happen. See how the text is smaller? So I'm going to keep it back. I'm going to go edit, paste without formatting. Okay, so then by, and then I'm going to put the creator of the image here. So whoever took the picture, the photographer. So it's the username. So the user is Steve P208. So I'm just going to copy that. I'm going to head back over here. And I am going to edit paste without formatting, and is licensed under, and then you enter the Creative Commons license here. So I'm going to go back over here. It says some rights reserved. I know that that means attribution. If I click on it, it'll take me to the actual license, and you can just copy and paste it from here. So it's CC by 2.0. You just copy that. Head back over here. And then I am going to edit, paste without formatting. And then once you're done putting in all of your citations, you can simply go up and go file, download as, and then you can download them as JPEG images, and then you can just put that JPEG right into your iMovie. So I hope that's helpful.